Hello and welcome. My name is Friso Lorscheider. I'm working in the mountain bike marketing team at DT Swiss. Today I would like to talk about the latest news if it comes to e-mountain bike wheels. It's already five years ago that DT Swiss first introduced e-mountain bike specific wheels into the market. To distinguish those wheels from our regular mountain bike lineup, we named those wheels hybrid. Since then, the e-mountain bike market developed quite a lot. Today with me is Niels Verhoeven, he's team leader in the product management team. Thanks Rizzo for having me. Thank you Niels for being here with me. Can you tell us a little bit about the details why the still very well performing hybrid wheels need to be replaced for model year 22? E-mountain bikes got more and more important in the last few years. The market experienced a diversification, bikes develop in different directions. With hybrid mountain bike, we have a clear fo focus on performance-oriented e-mountain bikes, which got more powerful to be able to climb faster and ride longer. These bikes use stronger motors, bigger batteries, and are still heavier than their non-electric brothers. It seems to be challenging to cope these demands with the new wheels. Yes, it is. When you think about our current mountain bike wheels, it is super hard to make them even stronger without adding unnecessary weight. The development base was our existing hybrid portfolio and had a closer look on every little detail. Compared to them, I think the most work went into the hubs. When you name here the hubs, can you tell us about the details of the hubs in those new wheels? As we are offering three different wheel models, there will be also three different hub models. All hubs got a whole redesigned hub shell to match the demands of, a new free, of the new free-up systems as well to match the design of today's e-mountain bikes. Besides these sturdier looking hub shells with reinforced spoke holes, we also developed and reinforced further parts of the hub and their free-up systems. You said free-up systems, so that's not just one system being used in all wheel models. No, exactly. In the next generation of hybrid wheels, we use three different kind of ratchet systems. The H1900 spline will be equipped with the Ratchet Allen system, which got introduced earlier this year. The H1700 spline got our classic Ratchet system with the 24 tooth hybrid Ratchets. For the HXC1501 spline 1, our carbon wheels, we developed a reinforced version of our EXP system. This system is called the Ratchet EXP Oversized, with specific oversized 30 tooth Ratchets to set a benchmark for EMTB use. So everything is redesigned, optimized, which is related to the additional weight of the motor and the battery of e-mountain bikes, which makes them much heavier than a regular mountain bike. What about the system weight? Yes, they are heavier. Like the previous hybrid wheels, all new hybrid aluminum wheels have a maximum system weight of 150 kilograms. The new HXC 1501 spline one with the carbon rim does have a maximum system weight of 140 kg, which is 20 kg more than before. So we talked now already about the hubs and quite important part of a wheel set, system weight. What about the rims on those wheels? As we have three different models, in this case we have also three different types of rims. The H1900 spline got a sleeve joint aluminium rim with a choice of 30 or 35 mm inner width and we are offered, it, offered them in 650B and 29. The HX1700 spline gets an upgrade to a welded rim, which is our strongest aluminium rim in our portfolio, with the same options if it comes to rim inner width or diameter like the H1900 spline. Finally, we have our HXC1501 spline 1 with a carbon fiber rim here we offer a 29 inch version with 30 mm and a 650B version in 30 and 35 mm too. So quite a lot of options, but to adapt the wheels to different bike types, are there other options like brake mount or free hub options? Yeah, as I told you before, the market is developing fast and we are facing more and more standards. So all of these wheels are available in center lock and ice brake mount to cover every disc option in the market. If it comes to free up body, the customer can choose between Shimano Hyperglide, Shimano Microspine or Ceramic D. And also, like the previous hybrid wheels, these specific free up bodies are made of steel. Those hybrid wheels are made and developed to match performance oriented e-mountain bikes. But at the moment we hear as well about 
so-called light support e-bikes. Are the hybrid wheels the right choice for those bikes as well? You can use these wheels and these bikes, but let's talk later about light support e-mountain bikes in another meeting. Okay then, thank you for joining me today, Niels. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. If you would like to get more details about our newest hybrid wheels, just check out our website dtswiss.com. Thank you for watching this video. Hope to see you soon again. Enjoy your bikes.